right, guys. My moon box came today. As you can see out the window, it's dark. So I just came in. Didn't want to wait till the morning. I want to see what's in my box. November's moon box. But before I um, open it, I want to thank Emily Thorne Rose, Alyssa Lee, James Fairchild, Carmen Garcia, Barbara Nibs, Marianne Donnarumma, Malta Ferris Chris. Thank you for subscribing. I know there's others. But I didn't know how to go back and get your names. You all are important to me, okay? I see every one of you. You are important. Don't think nobody doesn't see you, because I do. Anyway, let's get to the box. Here it is. Here's my letter telling me about everything. Uh... This is the top. Here's my card. Here's my piece of artwork. I don't know if you can see that. It's always pretty and it's heavy. And uh, like I've said before, I'm going to put it in my book of shadows. It looks like something on tarot cards possibly. Raven. It says, focus on your target, aim for the center, refine your technique. Sounds pretty good. It's a black box on the inside. And it's heavenly. Uh, white willow bark. Wild. Coffee bark. Shh. My dogs are carrying on. They hear dogs outside. As you can see, they tore my blinds down. Stop. Shh. Stop. Peckus. This is coleander root. I'm going a little bit faster because maybe I talk too much in the other ones. I don't know. But maybe this will suit you better. Here's my stone. Uh, I think it starts with an M. I, know, I can hear it in my head, but I don't want to try and pronounce it. My bath salt. Oh, it smells so good. I don't, I smell it on here and I see everybody else smell theirs. And I know you can't smell it, but if you ever buy one of these boxes, it is so worth it. It makes you uh, grow as a um, spiritual person in your walk. We all have separate walks, but it is awesome. And it smells like heaven. Like the all seeing eye. This, oh, I'm right. This is a uh, tarot oil. You can see it's got crystals and... I'm sorry about the light. It's later in the evening. I usually do this during the day. Peckus. Peckus.
some, I guess we will burn these. This is beautiful, and I think I know what this is. Oh my gosh. I think it's tarot cards. Yes. The hermet Hermetric Tarot. Oh my gosh. I am so happy with this. I have a set of tarot cards. I bought them for myself. Um, I only found out afterwards that that's okay, but it's better if somebody gifts you tarot cards. So, I am happy with this. I am. I can't wait to open them. Here's my candle for this month. And it's black paper. I don't know if you can see it. And it's got beautiful blue glitter on it. Here's my candle. It's showing up blue, but it's a purple. And it says prophecy. Yeah, it says prophecy. Little incantation. Uh, on this eve, I ask to receive the guided truth, so mote it be. Open is my soul as well as mind. Answers and revelation I seek to find. I allow the gods and pure intent to craft upon me the message that was meant. On this eve, I ask to receive from these magical tools, so mote it be. I like that. I like that. I don't feel any incense, so that's what must be, what these must be. Let's find out. And the one thing I have liked about when I've gotten these is, uh, I know I've said this in the other videos, but the little cards they send, I've not seen anybody else get the same card as me or the same message. So, I'm sure somebody has, but to me, it's it means a lot. It, it really means a lot. Um, just lets me know that they're not all just duplicated and they don't mean anything. All right, let's see what our little letter here says. Comes with a blank page, which I like. We are fascinated with the breaking the barriers between our spirits and the divine gods. We make deviation a daily... Uh, Daily ritual to receive answers and guidance through the use of the most ancient tools available to us. Using symbols, energies, and... I am not even going to try that word. When you synchronize things. Remerge yourselves in the beauty of realism as we are traveling on our journey through the dark half of the year. We focus November on the beautiful natural art of deviation... Whether you need answers or clar clarification, guidance or feedback, these tools can give you peace of mind and determination to take action day by day after day. There, this very natural art is necessity while working to thrive in the uncertain world around us. Open yourself up to receive inspiration. Open yourself up to be surprised and self-realized. 
Good, good, good. Always, re always important to remember that your path is sacred to your individual self. We recommend taking the time to connect with the items in this box and use them in a way that feels correct to you. Every practitioner resonates with different ideas and ways of performing rituals. We do not take this work lightly and strive to provide the highest quality ritual items for you to use. Be sure to clear your space and cast your circle of protection before performing any type of ritual. I like that because I do think we're all individuals, as I've said before. How I may practice may not be the way you practice, but it still, I think, has an undercurrent of it. And I like it. They don't push one certain way, and they tell you to protect yourself, and I think that's necessary. Um, the magical items in this box are as follows. The Hermetic uh, Tarot Deck. Love it. Uh, black and white designs. I'm not going to go all through it because it's, it's a lot. Um, we like to, we like to use our book of shadows or a journal to track our reading and document and document the messages they unfold. I, I do that with my dreams or what comes to me. I've never done it with tarot cards. I've played with them. A couple of times, or used them, I should say, used them. Because um, I don't think anything's a game. But uh, it's definitely something I need practice at. And something I've been wanting to get better at. Purple Tarot Satin Pouch. The color purple is very powerful, active color that can assist in developing your psychic abilities and intuition. Purple is often used during... Deviation as well as during spells related, and I know I'm mispronouncing that, to knowledge and uh, attainment of wisdom. Um, a large prophecy spell candle, which I read it to you. Before setting your space to burn this candle, meditate and focus on your intentions. Eye opener. Um, aura spray. I had to think about it so I could say it right. This aura, aura spray can be created with Palo Santo, ginger, sweet orange, and an eye opener magical oil from our personal cabinet of witchery. Included an amethyst crystal into the spray. That's nice. Um, ritual rope incense. I was right. Kinda. <laughs> Took me a minute. Um, ritual rope incense is made by monks living in monasteries and is prepared in a traditional of the Mon Monstaic Order of Tibet. It goes on to explain it. Uh, tarot Magical Oil. Powerful oil was created for you to anoint your tarot or self. Pythia. Sacred Salt. Uh, she was a high priestess of Apollo and Delphia who served as the oracle. White Willow Bark. Is used in love potions and spell work. Uh, Gal Angel Root. Worn. Aids in psychic development and guards the bearer's health. Wild Cherry Bark. For love and deviation. Um, the deviation signal. We have crafted this. Signals specifically for your deviation rituals and readings. Okay. Black Kainite. Okay. Uh, 
is a powerful stone and used to help during mediation and deviation. Personal Oracle Reading. We have meditated and selected a card from the Raven's Card Oracle to place inside your box. So, this. Parchment paper, writing stuff down. Tarot spread artwork. This beautiful dis dis description of a basic tarot layout was created for Moonbox and can be used for you to lay your cards on or add to your book of shadows. I will be adding it to my book of shadows, but I'll use it once or twice before I put it in my book. Uh, with a three card spread, past, present, and future. So I like that. The artwork is by Adrian Adriana Alden. And it's beautiful. It's beautiful. As you perform your ritual, do not set expectations. Cast your intention and be of pure heart and mind. These very personal moments are for you. There is such knowledge available to you. Take pleasure in knowing that you are becoming one with the earth, stars, and universe. Open yourself up to receive these beautiful gifts. We urge you to stay curious and hungry for knowledge. We are set free by the beautiful world around us. We send you love, light, and as you delve into your unique experience with deviation, the moon box. I love that. Well, I know I went a little fast and there was a lot of mess ups in this tape. Um, my dog's carrying on and stuff like that. Um, but I do like bringing the, the box to you. I thought maybe I'd change it up and y'all would like it better. Y'all let me know. Leave your comments. I love hearing from you. Remember, like, comment, and subscribe and I'll keep doing them and maybe since I did this kind of fast um, if y'all would be interested in if I did a, a ritual using them or how I used my cards or something like that let me know let me know and I'll try and do that or if there's anything else you'd like to know anyway Love my moon box. This isn't all that I get from it. I get so much more later in the month. And when I'm using them that I can't even speak of. But anyway, I appreciate all of you. It's wonderful being able to um, get to meet so many new people. Like I've said before. I'm not trying to reach 1 million viewers or anything like that. I just want to reach the one person out there who is as funny or I think there is as strange or as um, I am. <laughs> um, I definitely can't pronounce everything, but... I love it, and let me know what you think. Check out my other videos if you want to. Blessed be. I appreciate every one of y'all.